Brilliant news! In the 1991 Portuguese Grand Prix, British Formula One driver Nigel Mansell was the leader when he stopped to refuel and put on fresh tyres. However, due to a mechanics error, this happened. His team scrambled to change the tyre so he could get back into the race, but he was later disqualified for changing tyres outside of his team's pit stop. In a free practice session for the Chinese Grand Prix, Swiss F1 driver Sebastien Buemi was breaking for a corner when this happened. French rally driver Sebastien Auguier was racing along dirt tracks, fighting for first place in the Guanajuato Mexico rally when he encountered something odd on the road. His lightning fast reactions avoided the accident, but it was so close. Talking about close calls and fast reactions, these birds narrowly avoided an encounter with a 200 miles per hour Formula One car. In the 1993 Italian Grand Prix, Christian Fittipaldi was driving his Italian Minardi, battling his Italian teammate Pierluigi Martini when this happened. Thankfully, no one was hurt and Fittipaldi crossed the line in what has to be the most Italian car ever. Brad Keselowski lost control of his car when coming into the pit road for a late race stop in the Talladega Super Speedway race of 2019. Luckily, the only consequence was that he ended up facing the wrong way. Oh, and that his mechanics had to do some rapid reorganization. Unfortunately, the 2019 incident isn't the first time Keselowski has had trouble with a pit stop. In 2015, during the Windows 10 400 race, yeah, I know, not a great name for a race really, he completely overshot his pit stop, clipping one mechanic on the side and forcing another to jump onto the hood to avoid getting run down. Timo Schneider was leading a four-lap qualifying race for the World Rallycross race at Silverstone, when on the second lap his hood popped up, blocking his view. Amazingly, not only did he continue the race, but he went on to finish in second, only losing first place on the final lap. In the free practice session of the 2019 Azerbaijan Grand Prix, George Russell was driving his Williams at 140 miles per hour when this happened. A Formula One car creates so much negative pressure underneath it that the car is literally sucked to the ground. The Azerbaijan GP uses roads and streets as the racetrack and therefore has manhole covers. Due to the inexperience of the race organizers, they hadn't properly sealed the covers and so Russell's car literally sucked the cover up underneath it. To add insult to injury, the tow truck transporting Russell's car back to the pit lane also crashed when passing under a low bridge. During the 2008 Canadian Grand Prix, a safety car was called out and everyone dived into the pit lane to quickly change tyres. Kimi Raikkonen and Robert Kubica were stopped at the red light at the end of the pit lane, waiting to be allowed to rejoin the track when Hamilton did this. Apparently, he didn't see the red light at the end of the pit lane until it was too late. Which event did you think was the weirdest? Comment below and please like and subscribe for more.